Well, well for sure. I mean, we had, um, I, I was fortunate enough. I just decided, let me go to Ginger. I've never been there. And they had the school's championship there. And I was, I was in awe of what I saw. Good quality players that's playing at school level. And for sure, we took quite a few of the players from the school's tournament. They're in the squad, you know. And uh, we even brought a player from Ginger High School, secondary school, is that we selected to come to join the team. So they are great potential, huge potential. I'm looking at some of these girls now that we've seen with so much talent and ability to go to the under-20s. So I would say to Crested Cranes, they must be aware that they are under-20s coming for their positions in the national team. And it's a fact because I've seen, I've been with Crested Cranes now, and if I look at the players that's currently in the under-20, we've already worked on an under-20 team list. There are players that definitely coming, and I will put them in, the, in Crested Cranes. They are too good not to play there. And I need the Crested Cranes to know that we need better players, we need better competition. We want the best national teams uh, for Uganda and for FUFA, and that is where we're going to go. So we want to see the consistency. The 17 year olds now, 16 year olds, that will play in the under 20, that will go to all Africa games. 16 year olds that's coming from this team. There's, we cannot keep Agnes behind. We cannot keep Shadia behind. We need to put her, throw them in the deep end. It's the only way the girls will be able to prove if we make the level high. And they need to learn to fight. They need to fight and fight. And in that way, um, they will understand and they will learn. If they're not ready, they will go back to the under 17s. But there will definitely be a progression and a huge progression of players of under 20s that's going to crested cranes. And if I have my way, there will be two, three, 17 year old players as an under 17 team that will go to crested cranes. They will be the youngest players going to crested cranes. And I believe they deserve the opportunity. I believe they need to learn. We have to look to the future. We've got time to build crested cranes now. If they're once not making it in Crested Cranes, unfortunately, competition is what we need and we need the best players.